The budget for the Ministry of Interior has already been increased from about $2.35 billion to $2.75 billion in the upcoming fiscal year. But several MPs want the budget to exceed $3 billion. They say the Ministry of Interior and Security Forces need more assistance in the crackdown on terrorism. The funding will be allocated to several components from weaponry, equipment, training, logistics and even improving living conditions as they are fighting in tough desert terrains. Terrorists receive the modern equipment in all its forms from the black market and the security forces have to keep up to date with the anti-terrorism facilities. Egypt has launched a war on terrorists since 2014. The country has been suffering from terrorist attacks by ISIL-affiliated groups that infiltrated from its borders with Libya and Gaza after 2011. They have targeted security forces and civilians. But the military crackdown has succeeded in reducing the rate of violence in the country. The number of terrorist operations was around 4,000 in the last four years. That's about a terrorist attack every one and a half days. Now, weeks and months pass by without any attacks. Nearly 90% of the capabilities of these terrorist groups have been eradicated, and so goes the number of militants killed or arrested and their infrastructure. Egypt's budget is tight as it tries to reduce its annual deficit. So any increase in expenditure on security might be taken out from other vital sectors such as health or education. But most Egyptians we talk to have no complaints. Education and health care are important, but the budget is limited and security is more important. Without security, you cannot go to school for education. Without security, you cannot go to hospital for treatment. So security is ahead of everything. It will not affect education or health because there are other sources of income now. From the Suez Canal, the latest gas discoveries, production and state revenue is increasing. However, security should always be the top priority. A parliamentary meeting is expected with the ministers of finance and planning to seek the funds for the security forces. An approval has to be issued before the new fiscal year, which starts on July 1st. Yes, Hakim for CGTN, Cairo.